Empty parking lots and rides at Six Flags Great America tonight. The theme park is scheduled to remain closed under the governor's order until phase five. But as CBS 2's Vince Girasoli found, they have an extensive reopening plan they hope will jumpstart the rides much sooner. I have to tell you, it is kind of sad being here when there's nice weather and the park is so still and quiet. Still, management here at Six Flags Great America believes they can reopen safely, and today they shared with us their plans on how they think they can do so. In the stillness of a hot morning, you can imagine the happier times here. We uh, thrive in the summertime. It would be a very, very busy day at our water park and our theme park. Unfortunately, we live in these times where you have to be cautious. If nothing changes in Illinois, Six Flags Great America can't reopen until large gatherings are permitted. That's stage five. We are actually a 300 acre facility. But Park President Hank Salemi says that gives Six Flags room to be safe, social distanced and sanitized with the right adjustments. And he's lobbying the state to reconsider. It's just going to be different. It would start with an online reservation system, limiting entrance times and capacity. Attendance could be 2,500 or even well less on a potential opening day. We can control the amount of people and the amount of reservations we give out, just like a restaurant. A high-tech touchless canopy at the entrance would scan for temperatures and metal and bags are on visitors. Staff will be wearing masks and distance at wait lines would be enforced. Rides would run with empty seats separating parties and be sanitized after every pass. Park meals would also be ordered by hands-free mobile apps. It's going to be less people. It's going to be standing in line differently. It's going to be eating in our restaurants differently, and it's going to take some adjustment. To pull it off, Six Flags would need 4,500 seasonal workers, and they're already hiring just to be prepared. It's going to take more labor than we've ever hired before, simply because you need more people for sanitation, more people to make people stay socially distant. It would take a month to open up if permission is granted roller coaster world of COVID-19. Management insists these ideas are not just some vague plan. Every single one of these measures will be in place when their park in Oklahoma City reopens to the public on June 5th. At Six Flags Great America, I'm Vince Girasoli, CBS 2 News.